It's Yogi Matt. Today I want to show you a morning stretch routine that I do pretty much every single morning. It's good to do when you get up. If you can, get outside in the sun. Be your, be your feet on the earth. If it's colder, we'll just do it in your bedroom. If you can open the window, go for it. So let's get started. Take a little bit of a wide-legged stance. Just begin to let your arms go back and forth. This is a practice to both warm up the joints, warm up the body, stimulate digestion, and even more importantly, connect to our breath, connect to our body. Make sure you're breathing nice and slowly and fully. You can breathe through the nostrils for this one. warming up the spine. Notice how the mind wanders. Maybe you're already thinking about your day. Thinking about this video. Just stay with this movement. A few more breaths. If there's one thing you do, just do this. Empty coat sleeves. Rocking and breathing. Good, slowly coming back to center. Bring the feet to about hips width distance apart. We're going to really stimulate digestion, turn on the body. Turn on. We're going to flood the body with oxygen. How we do this, it's called horror breathing. We're going to reach the fingers up into the sky, fill all the way up, and then on the exhale you release, bend the knees, ha! So we'll do about 10 to 15, inhaling all the way up, Ha! 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 A few more. Ha! See if you can get a little louder. Ha! 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 One more. Ha! Good. Place the palms on the thighs, right, right above the knees. We're going to warm up the knee joints. So bend the knees and begin to make circles. Breathing. Good. We'll go the other direction. Back to center, forward and backwards just a few times. Bringing synovial fluid to the knee joint, so if you have knee problems, this is really good to do in the morning. I do this before at yoga or, or the gym, I, or if I'm not exercising, I still do this. Good. Release. Let's warm up the shoulders. Bring the palms to shoulder height. We'll begin by going forward. So shoulders, arm circles, small circles to start. Spread the fingers. Make sure you're connected to your breath. Medium circles. Good. Now nice full circles. Warming up the shoulders. Another breath. So I'm breathing through the nostrils. Good. Release the arms. We'll do shoulder shrugs backwards. Inhale the shoulders up. Fill up. Back. Exhale them down. Good. We'll do a few more. Really feel for drawing the shoulders up, back, and down, so you're kind of getting a little squeeze. And release. More shoulder shrugs. Actually, first shake it out. Shake out the legs. Shake out the arms. Shake out the wrists. Shake out the shoulders. 
check out the face. Just getting the energy moving in the body. Good. We'll do some more shoulder uh, circles. Palms, shoulder height. This time we'll go backwards. Spread the fingers. Small circles backwards. Breathing fully. Good. Medium circles. A little bigger. Shoulders may be burning a little bit. That's good. Full circles now. One more. Back to center. Shoulder shrugs. Palms by your side. Inhale the shoulders up, forward. Exhale down. We'll do about ten more. A few more. And release. Good. Inhale the palms up. Interlace the fingers. Reach straight up towards the sky. If you want to really feel your breath expanding into your chest, back, shoulders, nostril breathing still. Inhale, filling up. Exhale, forward fold. Good. Grab hold of the elbows. Let the neck relax. few breaths, let the exhales really carry you down, straighten the legs to the best of your ability. Don't, don't force it, it's still, maybe you're just warming up for the morning. And shake out the head and neck while you breathe. And slowly rise up one vertebrae at a time. Palms to heart center. Feel the energy you've woken up. You can let the eyes close. Still taking those full breaths. Staying very connected to the body. Notice how the mind wants to wander. This is the practice of coming into the present moment. Releasing the arms. This is a, a time you take. The, you take time for yourself. Honor your body. Honor your mind. Quick side body stretch. Inhale the left arm over your head. Inhale filling up. On the exhale, flow over to the other side. Fill up. Exhale over one more on each side. Inhaling, lengthening. Filling up. Exhale over. Good. Lengthen this inhale. Inhaling, exhaling back to center. Good. So usually I would do some um, some breathing exercise to stimulate digestion. I'll do just show you those quick. Those are in my videos relieving constipation and improving digestion. So the the breath of fire stimulate digestion for your day. Do this before breakfast. You can bring the palms behind the head so you open the chest, so it's a double action. You fill up about three-fourths inhale, and then breath of fire. So you're both stimulating digestion and toning the abdomen. Good. So you, you can do about 30 seconds to a minute of that. You can do two rounds if you'd like. Another one I do in the morning is the... Uddiyana bind to really press on the organs, stimulate digestion. Anything stuck gets moving, looks like this. Good, to save time I'll only do one of those. The two key exercises to do every day, twist. 
So right leg straight, left leg over. You can hug it in towards the chest for a few breaths. Stretch the hip. Good, we'll set up for the twist. Bring the elbow to the outside of the knee. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, twist. You really want to twist from the torso, not the upper back. Give your organs a nice squeeze, filling up. Exhale, back to center. We'll do the other side. Sitting up tall. Hug the knee in towards the chest. Stay present here. The mind wants to go somewhere else. This is the, one of the beauties of a yoga practice. Twist, twist. Bring the elbow to the outside of the knee. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, twist. And back to center. Your daily inversion. Great for digestion, brings fresh blood and oxygen to the, to the head, to the, to the brain. So you come onto your back, elbows by your side. You, the elbows are going to support your weight. So then you lift the hips, support your lower back with your palms. Half shoulder stand, breathe now. can stay here for 30 seconds, a minute, two minutes. This, this is one of those exercises to do every single day. Twists and inversions. Feel for breathing with the belly. Shoulders are slightly drawn together so you can still breathe into the chest. Good, and then on the exhale you slowly lower the hips all the way down. Feel free to do any other stretches that you'd like. Hopefully this is helpful. Have a great day. Namaste. Feel free to do a quad stretch after the squats or at the end of the workout. So you can just grab hold of the foot, stretch the thigh back. You can hold on to a wall, obviously, that would be helpful. But it's good to practice balance. Oh, and of course, feel free to jump. Actually, if you have a rebounder, feel free to jump on the rebounder.